Do you want to sell your coins, paper money, notes, valuable bills and stamps online? You can publish your ads for free on our website, thecoines.com. For mobile users it's much easier publishing coin ads using our Coines app. Hey coin collectors! In this episode I'm going to talk about Jefferson Nichols issued for 1963. First we will look into those minted in Philadelphia branch of the mint, find out current value at various grades, and then we will hop into Denver variants. So now I'm holding the circulated and weekly impressed 5 cents, both of them product of Philadelphia mint as they bear no mint mark. There are nothing special about this specimens, they are significantly abraded, display some amount of wear on high points and one of them is poorly struck on the reverse. In 1963, the United States Mint produced Jefferson Nichols that had full steps on the reverse side. Full steps refer to the steps on the Monticello building on the reverse side that are fully defined and visible. This is an indication that the coin was struck with full detail, making it more desirable for collectors. Neither of this two can attain this designation if graded. While 1963 Jefferson Nichols with full steps are not necessarily considered rare, they are difficult to find in high grades. This is because many of the coins produced were not struck with full steps, making those that were more valuable. The value of a 1963 Jefferson Nickel with full steps depends on its condition and rarity. Examples in higher grades such as MS-65 and higher are probably from rolls or mint sets. MS-66 examples are scarce despite the very large mintage. Examples in MS-67 with are really scarce with less than a handful known and none being finer. This is 1963 nickel in mint state 67 with full steps. His registry grade coin displays satiny nickel silver luster and bold design elements. Only the most microscopic grazes are discernible with a loop. It was sold for $3,600 in 2022 at Heritage Auctions. One of the most valuable examples however is this Jefferson Nickel also in MS-67 FS condition. This superb gem was sold for $5,907.38 including buyer's fee at Great Collections Auction. All Jefferson Nickels from the 1960s are scarce with full steps. The 1963D is no exception and it is also one of the tougher dates with full steps characteristics in any condition. Despite being scarce and with full steps it is also really scarce in MS-66 condition even without full steps. This is 1963 D. Jefferson Nickel in Mint State 65 with full steps. A reflective gem with exceptional eye appeal and bold design types. Both sides have light gold toning with slightly reflective fields. It was sold for $7,475 at Heritage Auctions. Thanks for watching guys. If you have rare coins you can post them for sale on our website, thecoines.com. Don't forget to hit the like button. Have a good one.